हेलो स्टूडेंट्स माय नेम इज प्रियंका एंड आई एम योर डिजिटल मेंटर सो टुडे आई एम हियर टू स्टार्ट विद द चैप्टर नंबर थ्री दैट इज मेजर लैंडफॉर्म्स सो लेट्स किक स्टार्ट लुक एट द पिक्चर एंड फिल इन द ब्लैंक्स इन द फॉलोइंग सेंटेंसेस सो चिल्ड्रन आर यू एबल टू सी द पिक्चर आर प्लानट अर्थ वॉज फॉर्म अबाउट फोर पॉइंट फाइव बिलियन ईयर्स अ गो at the beginning the earth was very different from what it is now there was no atmosphere and no water bodies on the surface on the earth according to theories of geology the present day continents were formed due to fragmentation of a huge simple mass of land the earth's crust comprises number of large plates of solid rocks flo floating on the liquid mantle the earth's crust comprises a number of large plates of solid rock floating on the liquid mantle the molten rock of the earth's mantle is in constant motion due to convenience of heat that occur deep inside due to the internal motion some of the plates are constantly sliding at the edges in relation to others this kind of continuous movement detached one plate from other the broken piece of land mass then drifted away from each other and caused the division of the continents the separated land mass are known as continents the land surface of the earth is divided into seven continents that are asia africa north america south america antarctica europe and australia now see different land forms of the earth the surface of the earth is not the same everywhere some areas are flat low and even some are little high above the sea level let us learn the basic land forms of the earth mountains let's see what are mountains mountains are often joined together in a line it is known as, known as mountain range the largest mountain range is the himalayas the topmost part of the mountain is called its peak the highest peak is mount everest at 8448 meters the highest peak is mount everest at 8000 and 848 meters above sea level the mountain peaks are always covered with snow and ice the next is plateau a plateau is a flat table and which rises sorry a plateau is a flat table land which rises abruptly from the surrounding areas rich mineral deposits like iron mica and limestone are found in this region valleys and plains the low area between the hilly is known as a valley plains are large stretches of almost flat land they are generally fertile because of rivers flowing through them the plains along the sea coast are called coastal plains desert Now see what is desert. A desert is a large area of land covered with sand. Sandstorms are very common in the deserts. The Sahara Desert is the largest hot desert in the world. Camel is called the ship of the desert. Now children see the pictures of the various landforms. Peninsula. A peninsula is an extension of land into a sea. or ocean it is surrounded by water on the three sides now see what are islands an island is a piece of land surrounded by water on all sides a group of islands close together in the sea is known as an archipelago different water bodies on the earth now see that how many different water bodies we have on our earth There are various water bodies on the surface of the earth. Rivers, lake and seas are 
some of the water bodies now see the rivers river is a big channel of water many streams join together to form a river the point where the river start is called its source the point where it ends is called its mouth now see what are lakes a lake is a water body surrounded by land there are both fresh water and salt water lakes seas seas are bodies of salt water smaller in size to oceans the mediterranean sea black sea and the arabian sea are some of the important seas now children it's time to looking back the topmost part of the mountain is called its peak. A plateau is a flat table land which rises abruptly from the surrounding areas. The low area between the hills is known as valley. The point where the river starts is called its source. The Sahara Desert is the largest desert in the world. An island is a piece of land surrounded by water on all sides. A lake is a water body surrounded by land. Seas are bodies of salt water smaller in size to oceans. So children, I thought you all understood it. Yes? So it's time to take your leave and bye.